What's going on, Brand Fam? You already know who it is. It's your boy, Mr. Brandon F. On another fabulous episode of I'm Hungry, Damn It. Huh? It's Brandon, bitch. Welcome back, guys. I'm on my way to my homeboy's house once again. I was walking out of 7 Eleven and I grabbed. Well, y'all know how much I love beef jerky, right? Right? Anyways, I was in 7 Eleven and I see that Jack Links has a brand new beef jerky out. You know what I'm saying? It's a brand new flavor that I didn't even know was out. It's called the Jack Links Wild Bacon Cheddar. That's the flavor. It seemed like whenever I'm on my way to his crib and I stop at the store, I always end up picking up something that I don't need to pick up. Like if you guys are familiar, the last time I had grabbed the Hot As Fuck Slim Jim on my way to his crib, you know, so it's the same. Oh shit, who the fuck is that? Oh fuck. I'm sorry, Brand Fam. Um, yeah, we finna cross over. I see somebody that I am not trying to see and I don't need them coming to beg me for shit. I ain't got nothing and I'm not sharing nothing. So hold on, Brand Fam, we finna cross over. We're going to cross this highway and I'm going to walk on the alternate side of the street because. All right, I'm sorry about that brand fam. I just ran into, well, I didn't run into her. I spotted her before she could spot me. So I just figured, you know, I would cross you know, the street or whatever, so, you know, that she wouldn't, you know, see me. She's walking back towards that way, but I didn't need to risk it. That's Funky Breath Tina, you know, when I first got down here, you know, you always want to be nice, you want to help somebody out. It was always like, oh, you know, do you have a dollar? Do you have a dollar? And at first, like I said, I was new here, so, you know, I gave it to her the first, like, couple of times, but then I started to see that it was a pattern. You know, she always, you know, got her ashy ass hand out begging for some shit. You know what I'm saying? And I don't think that's cool because, I mean, we all struggle. You know what I'm saying? We all got to, you know, be adult sometime and grow the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? You can't be going through life with your motherfucking hand out. I, I, I have a low tolerance for people like that. But anyway, like I was saying, um, you know, she just would always hit me up. It was like the first couple of times I gave it to her. It was a habit. It was like every time I seen it, that was always the first thing out of her mouth. And then eventually it turned me off. So my thing is like, you a grown ass woman, you know, go and get that shit. That goes to, you know, anybody I fuck with, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got to go and get that shit. I don't, I don't, I don't really, I don't really do all that. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm starting to think about it. I didn't have it for you a couple of weeks ago. I didn't have it for you six months ago. I didn't have it for you two years ago. The only time that I had it was when I very first ran into you those first couple of times. After that. I didn't have it no more for you. Like, what don't you get? Stupid. I mean, that's what it is. But enough of that. I ain't gonna rant about Tina. No more. We finna get into this. Y'all, y'all see that? That Jack Link wild bacon cheddar. So, brand fam, y'all already know what I'm about to do. We about to get this review cracking. First, I gotta open it up. So, I'm gonna need y'all to bear with me. All right, so Brand Fam, we finally got it open, and we're going to start this review in three, two, one. Let's make it happen.
All right, Brand Fam. I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion. I got my money's worth. That's right. That's right. I got my money's worth. And I've had bad beef jerky before, but this wasn't one of them. I feel like with Jack Lynx, I prefer their jerky. I tried when they had the, um, what do you call it? The pickled sausages that one time. And the pickled sausages I thought were good, but nothing ever compares to their jerky. The jerky is like, it don't taste like nothing else. You know, like how you got Slim Jim and um, I think Tombstone, they had beef jerky a while ago. I don't know if they still do, but Jack Lynx is something about Jack Lynx. I don't know. They can make beef jerky. They can make pickled sausages. Shit, Jack Lynx is so good, hell, they could probably even make booty jerky. That's what it is. So, Grand Fam, I'm going to say I got my money's worth, definitely. If you're a fan of beef jerky, if you're a fan of bacon and cheddar, like me, go ahead, go out, get that Jack Lynx wild bacon cheddar beef jerky. Like I said, once again, I got it from 7-Eleven. So, Grand Fam, y'all know what to do. If you like this video, hit like, hit subscribe. Drop in my comments. Let me know what you all want me to try next, all right? I got to go because I got to cross back on the other side of the streets because he stay on that side of the street. Like I said, I was just trying to avoid Funky Breath Tina, but she's out the picture. I don't see her anymore, so I'm going to cross back over and head to my boy's house and enjoy this beautiful day. And I want you guys to all do the same, all right? Mwah! Love you. Until next time, Brand Fam. Uh. Brandon F. Brent, 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 Brent.